What's up everybody, it's Flux with FluxWithIt.com and today I'm here to show you uh, Alchemy by Camel Audio and uh, essentially what I want to show you because this is such a deep program there's so many different things that you can do with it I'm just going to give you kind of bite sized bits and I'll probably do a few videos on it but the first thing I wanted to show you is as a machine user, machine being my primary uh, tool I like to show people how plugins map uh, to the controller uh, because machine has that auto mapping feature and some plugins it doesn't work so well some plugins it works great luckily alchemy it works perfectly uh, so what I'm going to show you here is this is kind of like our, our performance view uh, that shows our browser for sounds and we can go through and select sounds and then down here you'll see our performance controls we have eight knobs here and they can be uh, assigned basically to whatever you want then you have two XY pads and those parameters can be assigned to whatever you want then you have your ADSR settings here and your remix pads which is kinda like a morphing thing if you're familiar with something like core uh, it lets you morph between presets which is pretty nice and you've got your volume level here and of course your mod wheel and then octave uh, so essentially on the machine controller you're just seeing control 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 but you know this this can be a problem for some plugins but for this one it's actually not these are actually those first set of eight macro controls right here so what we can do is you turn this up and down and you're gonna see it's going right in a line with one two three four five six seven eight very fast and easy to tell what you're looking at you know you do want to look at the screen when you're seeing that just to know which parameter you know number four is going to which is filter two uh, but aside from that it's really fast and easy to tell what it's mapped to now when I press the over button you're gonna see I get another page and there's my XY control so I have XY and I have also XY2 which is right here So if I want to control it, now of course I can just click on it and drag it around as well, which is nice. I have a um, the magic trackpad over here, so I can just press down and kind of use it just like a kind of like a chaos pad or something, you know. So um, and then if I press over again, well actually I don't even have to press over again. Here's your X Y's. Then I have my ADSR is right here. So then I can go over and I get my remix. So this is going to let me go right through remix X, remix Y. So kind of just like core where you could move your remix pad around. I can do that with this as well. Very cool. So it's very fast to be able to get new, new sounds out of it. And then moving on from there is you're kind of more standard stuff like your filter one cutoff resonance your drive FX mix filter two cut resonance so forth and so on and it, it kind of runs through all the parameters that you would like to see which is really awesome so realistically it, it's pretty much a hundred percent hands-on control whereas a lot of the other plugins I feel like you know I have to kind of do a little finagling sometimes or use the mouse a lot you know but with this it's it's really straightforward on that very nice and of course you can set these eight knobs to whatever you want so if you feel like there's something that you need to get to first you can set it up 